1000 email versus 1000 WhatsApp outreach messages. Which one is the better method and what results can you expect from sending out a thousand of each? Let's first take a look at email. And there is a general rule. Don't do what others do. Because business owners have an internal spam filter to filter out all the marketing emails. They only want to see the emails of friends, family, business partners or customers. So make a title and the first sentence to look like it comes from one of these people. And here I have a script example for you. As a subject, we say their address. And then, hey John, honestly now, did you spend your youth dreaming about someday hard pasting entire Excel pages into Google Sheets and then manually making adjustments one sheet at a time to determine payouts? This is a great first message because first of all, it doesn't look salesy or marketing at all. And second of all, if they have ever experienced something similar like this, it will put a smile on their face and they are more likely to actually respond. Also look at how detailed this message is. It goes really in the detail of the emotion, how the people feel. And if this is something your niche is usually experiencing, then they feel understood. And in sales, everything is about making them feel understood. Because if they think you understand them, they think you can solve their problem. The metrics of 1000 automated emails are about 36% opening rate, which means 360 emails opened. Then 7.7% of the opened will reply, which is about 28. And then about three people will book, which is about 10.7% of the people that replied. Moving on to WhatsApp, it is completely different. On average, on WhatsApp, the opening rate is 98%. And this is actually logical, because on WhatsApp, you usually write to your friends, family, and people you already know. So you're more likely to actually read the messages from WhatsApp because you don't get a lot of outreach messages. It's also why I say it's so strong and so many people miss out on this. Now, because it's so unusual to get a cold marketing messages by WhatsApp, you also want to come across as human as possible. I mean, we all know the phishing attacks we get by SMS that they say, ah, oh, they're our bank and we should log in or that they're Amazon and we have a package delivered and now we have to log in. So they get our login details. You have to make sure to not write salesy at all and to not look like a scammer. This means never ever send a link by WhatsApp because then they will instantly put you in the package of a scammer and they will never answer you, they will block you. A script that worked great for me is, Hey John, try to find your socials for ages and figured it would be best to write a WhatsApp. I can bring you three kitchens and bathroom clients this month if you're interested. Are you free to chat this Thursday at 3 p.m.? Now let's analyze the script. We start with Hey, first name which is why it's important to know the first name of the client. And then we move on with the sentence to basically just say why we found them to give a bit of excuse why we reach out via WhatsApp and to make sure they see us as human and not as scammers. Then we move directly to the offer and finish off with a strong CTA. The CTA is a call to action and basically we want to get a yes or no there. With WhatsApp, we always try to get a yes or no with the CTA and get on a call with them as fast as possible. So they can see we are a legit business and we are not some weird scammer. Now, as you see, there are no links. And if they say yes, they have time. Then you send them, okay, what's the best email to send the invite link? And you will send the invite link by email. The metrics of 1000 WhatsApp outreach messages. 78% opened, which means 780 people opened the messages. And this is not 98 because not everyone has actually WhatsApp. From the people who have WhatsApp, the opening rate is 98%. 35% reply rate of the openings, which means 273 people actually reply to the message. And 3.6% booking rate, which means 10 meetings booked. Now email is definitely good and has its place in cold outreach. But if you're not using WhatsApp, then you miss out on a great opportunity. Because WhatsApp is more than three times stronger as cold email. You don't know how to do WhatsApp outreach with Go High Level or how to get leads. If you sign up with my affiliate link on Go High Level, I will give you a list of 10,000 business owners that you can directly reach out on WhatsApp. I did a complete WhatsApp outreach video and you can find it here or also in the description.